Ooh, that's a good boy. Ooh, that's a good boy. One firearm. That's a good boy. Uh -uh. All right, that's enough. Good boy. That's enough. All right, all right. You can't eat the whole deer. Well, I got good news, fellas. I found your coyote. I want to think about your story before we talk. front of the truck, turn around, face away from me. You got any weapons on you? I got a pocket knife in my right front pocket. Okay. No pistols, handguns, nothing like that. Right there, is that what you're talking about? Yes, Alright, turn around, put your hands behind your back. I just need to secure you for a minute. Okay. What's your name, sir? Tyler. Tyler what? Oh my goodness. <laughs> Tyler, you're not gonna fit. Alright, we're gonna do it like that right here for now. Who's in the back seat there? His brother. Okay. Do me a favor, just turn around and put your butt against that grill right there. Come on out, partner. Just keep your hands where I can see them. Walk on back to me and turn around. You got any weapons on you? Don't put your hands down like that, bud. Turn around. You got any yeah, weapons got on you? Okay, that's all I'm worried about for right now. Don't worry about a phone, nothing else. Maybe a lighter. All right, fresh out of handcuffs, you get lucky. Come on over here with you, buddy. Just get over there. Listen, guys, I'm in the dark by myself in the middle of nowhere. Three guys that just shot a gun, okay? Not trying to treat you like crap. I just got to see what's going on, all right? Yes, sir. Clear? Yes, sir. All right. Florida 132, Quebec, Tango, Romeo. It's a white Chevy Silverado, and I'll have three detained at this time. Standing by for backup. Gonna secure this. Just gonna secure this gun for now. Who was in the back of the truck? Come on, guys. In the back of the truck. The, the bed of the seat? truck. Yeah. Nobody. I swear. What you say, sir? Who's in the back of the truck? Nobody. The bed of the truck. Nobody. Why? I just saw him through the window. Then it looked yeah. like somebody was sitting in the back of the truck with no, their back sir. against the toolbox. No, no, I was in the back seat. Hey, yeah. We not did a darn thing wrong, Bob. All right, we're gonna figure it out. I got some people coming to help me out, but I can't, right. I can't watch y'all and check this and everything else. Okay. Yeah, you can check. Hey, my the gun, my gun. When I seen you throw the lights on, I got scared. My gun's behind the truck. Okay. And right there in the fern. Okay. Cool. Very good. No, so. I ain't gonna lie to you about all right. I appreciate that. I appreciate hey, that. Will you please? I get claustrophobic bad. I ain't <laughs> killed nobody, Bob. I mean, this is, we ain't did nothing wrong, man. All right, we're going to find that out, well, okay? Let me, I'm, I can claustrophobic. Claustrophobic from what? You got air conditioning? Can you feel the air? Oh, I, my dang hand, Bubba. I ain't hey, did this guy's wrong. hands are hurting, too. Hey, turn around. Don't come walking back. What around. are, I mean, what are we in trouble for? You guys are under suspicion of night hunting, all right? <laughs> I don't know who you are, whose property this is. You shot own, something with a gun or not. So many acres. Okay. If you're getting me out of here, I'll have the land owner here in 10 minutes. It don't matter. How are you related to the landowner? He's my grandpa, and it's okay. my dad's place. Okay. All right, all right. I know everybody that lives around here. That guy there's one of my good friends. And Dell Middleton lives there. I know everybody here, man. Okay. All right. Well, like I said, I can't go see what y'all did. Yeah. I, and then sit here and babysit y'all yes, at the same sir, time. I, I understand. Okay. Three guys in the dark I with just, a gun. This is it's so uncomfortable, man. We got it. Well, they're not made for comfort. All right. Well, when I, I get everybody I, secure, I, when I, I get some backup I, here, then we will uh, we'll go from there. Will you, will you please let me out the vehicle? I can just stand there. I can't run away. 
Why are you freaking out, man? Because I get, I get claustrophobic, man. All right. So here's what Which I want. Which one are you? You Dwayne? Yeah. Stand right there. <laughs> You've been yeah. around here your whole life, and Stand you didn't act like yeah. that. And I know what goes on around here, so don't Not play that. Me, Come here. Mama. Stand right here, please. Who are you? Dwayne North. Right there. What? He's lived here his whole life. Oh, yeah. God. And I know what goes on around here, guys. Bubba. <laughs> you can think whatever you want to think about okay. us. Slide back against the truck. I got some deputies on the way. They're going to babysit y'all. We're going to get all this sorted out. Right. You guys might go Hello, home tonight. No problem. Okay. Go ahead. See, my dang radio don't even work up here. You wonder why I'm treating you guys like this. I'm in the dark in the middle of the woods by myself. Three guys with guns. Well, Come on, man. Right. You've lived I ain't going to take no chances. Life. How many guys do you think around here don't have guns? I know, exactly. That's the point. Here we go. Now I got some help. Hang tight right there against that truck, bud. You're pacing around nervous. You make me nervous. <laughs> you darn right, because them things hurt. All right, we'll get it sorted out. Like I said, I got some help right here. Six, four, seven, here, Landon. How we doing, fellas? No. I got three right here. Hey, stay where I told you. He's nervous as a... Come back here to the bumper. Come back to the bumper. You stay there. You stay at the bumper. All right, so... They shot something. I don't know what. Over there. I got a dog. It's going to take me a little bit to figure this all out. I just kind of need some somebody to babysit. Yeah. Can you, uh, you feel comfortable going by yourself? Yeah, yeah, I can do that fine by myself. Go stay with these Did you search them? You want them all separated? They've been padded down. That one's got a, yeah, we need them all separated. That okay. one's got a pocket knife in his pocket. I ran out of cuffs, so it, they all got pocket knives. No firearms, though. Turn around. 6417 Orlando. My radio I don't know if I can do this, Bubba. Okay, relax. Man, I'm not working. SO is 297. You got two? Hey, I'm for real. Man, I am claustrophobic. No, no, no. Put him in the front. He's fine. He's good. They're good people. Right. Yeah. Can y'all put mine in the front for real? I don't have any I'll, objection I'll, I'll, I'll to that. One time, one time, one time. Just both sit him right here. I mean, gosh dang, this is my property. I know. That's right. <laughs> I mean, see, I don't know that. I know I'm sitting down the road. I see a spotlight. I hear a boom. Yeah, so that's all right. So there's some young kids around here do some stuff for all Well, see, that's part of the problem. Are y'all the ones on the ATV? <laughs> No, that I've been getting information about? No, hey. Probably right. else they call. No, we'll they were car. on our property okay. spinning up. Yeah. He can go in front. He can go in front. All for two Running weeks over now. Sprinklers. I've been coming over here checking. Cause this Eric, get the third one over this here. Bat, the, this batch is over here, partner. destroyed. Yeah, no problem. This is, what do you say, Tyler? Yes, sir. All right. Right there where you just bought that house. I patrol over there every night, too, because people are destroying our stuff. Oh, I know. You know where you bought the house? Oh, yeah. Yes, sir. Same place. Shot over there twice last night. Yeah, I know. That's why. That's why, why, that's why Mr. North's out here. I mean, what, what, and shooting did nothing wrong. I shot two, two coons in a box trap. <laughs> no, the night before last. In behind that house you bought. That's all our property. I know it is. He is not cuffed. He is just being very cooperative and pretending he is because I ran out of handcuffs. No, I'm cuffed. Oh, you cuffed him? Okay. I'm the one that was. You are cuffed. That's right. Yeah, he's pretty. If y'all got a second set or want to cuff him in front, he's pretty big. He's got to be hurting. If you don't mind. Give uh, North his cuffs back and put him in there. You got your second? Yeah. Nope, nobody's been run. They all need to be separated. I got to interview them. Yeah, no problem. So on and so forth. Yeah. Roll it out. Oh, sorry.
right. you for a sec. Yep. Tip it off right. I just know it's going to be up here. I don't know anything. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I've been getting complaints of oh, yeah. sheep deer up here. Um, I'm afraid they might have missed. I don't know. They were over there for a little while looking. But he admitted to throwing his gun in the fernery when he saw me. So i got to find the gun. Okay. <laughs> Why he would have done that, I don't know. He said he got scared. But okay. then he said he's shooting at a coyote. There are so, co there are, and other coyotes up here too. Yeah. But i got a little more information than what I'm letting on. So there's a reason there. There's a reason they're here. Yeah. Between you and me. I oh, know. Um, so, um, like I said, I got another FWC unit yeah, coming. Yeah, but, but, uh, but it's, don't let them get their story but, but straight also, and all that stuff. But also, I, they were working on their dog boxes today. I saw them at the Hayes Hardware. So, mm -hmm. I think they were running their dogs. Yeah. I didn't hear any dogs. But, no, they just they pulled right in the fernery, started working the lights, stopped down there on the back side of this yeah. little pond, and kabow! And I came up blacked out and called them coming out. There's nothing in the truck, of course. All right, we'll separate them. Yeah, just separate them. Look. No, come on. Got enough paperwork for everybody, maybe. All we'll do is we'll print out the Davids on all three for you. Yeah. I need to get in here, guys. And there ain't no telling what's going to come flying out when I open this door because it's absolutely full of crap. Uh, Go ahead. Sixty-four seventeen Orlando. Sixty-four seventeen. I apologize. My portable is absolutely useless here. I got the SO with me. We got three detained. We're going to be deploying canine to look for a weapon and a deer. And yes, I would appreciate some additional FWC assistance. Who's that truck registered to? Mom. It's yours? Okay. Yes. Stay, wait. Come here. Come here. Come Perch it up. Perch it up. 
Peki. Köşürüm. Stupid. it up. Who's that? Check here. No. Check here. Check here. That's a good boy. Oh, that's a good boy. One firearm. Oh, that's a good dog. Hey, that's a good dog. One firearm discarded in the fernery. Oh, that's a good boy. Weapon still hot? Uh, I think there's one in it. Yes, sir. That's the gun I was telling you about. Yep, we found it. Come here. People that ain't doing nothing wrong don't hide their gun in the bushes, man. I don't bushes, think man. about shining, coyotes, or none of that. Yeah, You don't know the laws about shining and coyotes, but you're doing it. You don't know the laws about shining in coyotes, but you're doing it. Ten minutes later after it's shot, the mic comes ripping up on you. Yeah. Yeah. If I know something wrong, I'd have been gone. So, I mean. All right. Come on. Back to work. What's that? Search it up. Get him. Search him up. What's that? Hey, come on. Oh, get him. Oh, get him. Oh, get him. Oh, get, him. Oh, get that thing. Oh, that's a good boy. Oh, that's a good boy. Hey. That's a good boy. That's a good boy. That's a good boy. Six, four, seventeen, Orlando. Sixty-four, seventeen. Show one freshly killed ten-point buck recovered by canine. Ooh, that's a good boy. Yes, sir. That's a good boy. Uh uh. Uh uh. Uh-uh. All right, that's enough. Good boy. That's enough. That's enough. Where is uh, 54 at, Orlando? Ten four. That's a good boy, Maxie. Woo, good boy. All right, all right, you can't eat the whole deer. That's a good boy. That's a good boy. All right. Come on, guys. I ain't leaving this deer here. Come on. All right, we'll figure something out. Come on. Come on. That's a good boy. That's a good boy. I know. Ooh, that's a good boy. Come on. Ah! 
Well, I got good news, fellas. I found your coyote. I want to think about your story before we talk. Come on. Ooh, that's a good boy. Yes, sir. Get him. That's a good boy. I gotta go down there and secure that so it doesn't right. disappear from some crazy my luck, you know. Alright, no problem. I'll be right back. Hey. Ten point buck. What? It's a ten point buck. Oh. Is that fucking rig right there? Four seventeen, six four fifty four, tack two. What a shame, buddy. You're a good little buck. Sixty four fifty four, tack two. When you get here, you're going to see a deputy out there with no lights on, with three. Do not pull in that road where the suspect vehicle's parked. I think my phone flew out somewhere there. I don't want you to run it over. I need you to come back to my blue lights in the back of the fernery so we can load this gear up.
Good boy, Maxie. That's my man right there. Yeah, he's down there. Okay. Just follow me, I'll pull past it, and then there's a road on the back side we can all turn around. Okay. So I was just coming back up to look for my phone. I think it must have flew out. I had it charging on the seat when they shot. I was sitting on the other side of this pond here, they were right down in there, and wow! Okay. Then they left, no deer. I was like, holy crap. Did they throw the gun? Yeah. He told me he threw the gun right off the bat. He goes, hey, I got scared when I saw you. I was just shooting at a coyote, but I got scared, so I threw my gun. <laughs> so I put the dog out, dog found the gun. I said, all right, well, let's go find your coyote. Started walking back where I had seen him stopped, working the dog, working the dog, right to him. I came up, I said, good news, I found your coyote. Hey. Right. Hey. Gotta go? Nope. Are you cool to hang out? Cool to hang out. What you got there? That's the bio ball three. Copy. Oh, okay. Sweet. So we have... Conversations been kind of light and kind of... Okay. Well, what we did is we just copy the... Yep, yep. I got you. Other word right. documents easier. Yeah, I appreciate that. Alright. Tyler, come with me please, sir. Hang out right here. You are Tyler Braddock? Yes, sir. Alright, Tyler. Where are you from? You from up here, too? I grew up in Pearson, living in Alright. How you know these fellas? I grew up around them. Just grew up around them? Y'all go to school together? Or? Yes, sir. Oh. Royce. Okay. They're a little bit older than you, aren't they? A little younger than me. Alright, I gotta read you something before we talk about what happened tonight, okay? Yes, sir. You have the right to remain silent. Anything you say can and will be used against you in a court of law. You have the right to talk to a lawyer and have him present with you while you are being questioned. If you cannot afford to hire a lawyer, one will be appointed to represent you before any questioning if you wish. Do you understand each of these rights as I have explained them to you? Yes, sir. With these rights in mind, do you wish to talk to me right now? Uh, am I being arrested? Yes. Uh, I'm going to hold off. You're going to hold off? Okay. What else did you end up having on you? I just had a pocket knife in this pocket. Okay. My wallet and phone. Uh, well, which... Where's your phone at? Thank you. Oh, front pocket, not side pocket. Alright, come on over here and have a seat in the truck. I'll leave you uh, like you are. Hold on, let me move that little seat there. Forgot I threw that in there. You want to have a seat? Nope. Nope. Invoked? Yep. Okay, mine too. Can you fit it? Can you get in there, man? That is not going to be comfortable. Alright. Y'all just hang out with him. Just stick your feet out. Just sit there on the seat. Alright, he doesn't support the same thing. Alright, we'll put your wallet and your phone and all that stuff right here on the front. Trevor, come on over, sir. Let's do the back there. Hang out right here. Alright, I gotta read you something before we talk any further about this, okay? You have the right to remain silent. Anything you say can and will be used against you in a court of law. You have the right to talk to a lawyer and have him present with you when you're, while you're being questioned. If you cannot afford to hire a lawyer, when we appointed you, represent you with it before any questioning if you wish. Do you understand each of these rights if I explain them to you? Yes. All right. With these rights in mind, do you wish to talk to me now? No. Nah. Okay. Um, Y'all got a cage? 
Uh, John does, yeah. Okay. Any other property on you? No, sir. Just some money. Knife. Oh, yeah, that's my hot yeah, dog. He got, he got my out. razor. Right. Can GCSL hold one of them? Yeah, they're going to have to. Probably going to have to transport one of them. Alright. Put him in a cage somewhere. I'm going to leave your money in your pocket, okay? Come on. Put him behind his back. Hold him. Sit I'm going to take these off of you if you freak out. You know it ain't going to go well, right? Uh, can I get my wallet? Where's your wallet? In my truck. I'll get it. What about my phone and all that? Will I be able to get it back? It will either go to the jail with you as property or go with the truck when the truck gets towed. Yes, sir. You want it to go to the jail with you? Uh, yes. Put them okay. yeah, please. What about the knife? Can I just stick that in the truck? Yeah, just throw that in the Okay. Wherever. But, hey, all right, hold on. Yes, you got to put them back. I got your wallet. Yeah, yeah, it's going yeah, with you. I'm going to stick it right there with your phone. And the pocket knife is on the, the fold-down center thing, just where that bandana yeah, see, and stuff yeah. was. I just set it on uh, top of that. Did you put that my light there? Yeah. No. I, yeah, that's your light. All right. all right, just make, please make sure nothing falls out of that. I got all yeah. kinds of credit cards in there. Yep, I got you. I'll keep holding ah. on. You got him, John? Yep. <laughs> You're good, man. I don't know if it's going to be any better. He's a big guy. Well, I'm just saying so he can, we can close the door and get him out. Uh, yeah. Can you fit? Yeah. What? Anybody in the back? I'm just going to start paperwork. They've all three invoked Miranda. They don't want to talk, so um, I'm going to start paperwork, but that guy's huge, and he's won't even, my door won't even shut. Oh, no I problem. Got a, I got uh, a very small transport cage in this truck, so. No problem. Uh, I can transport uh, two of them right to the jail. I've done it, too. Okay. Sure. All right. Um, do you have the ability to submit to it? You... We're all temple. If you want to take Megan with you to go do evidence, I can take him with him to the jail. Okay. That's 10 4, and I'm going to have three adult males, 10 15 for 68 November. I'll get you some 43 in just a minute. No, I understand. But you understand why I. Yeah, that's fine. As long as they're secure, so I can start paperwork. Yeah, no, he's in mine. Okay. And put the other two in there? Yeah. All right. Just search him again. I just kind of roughly patted him down. John, just search him again real quick. Okay. We're going to put him in there, too, just because well, this ain't going to work. <laughs> we can go into something a little bigger. Yeah, he's got a lot more. out of the bugs. Yeah. Since Come on over, partner. <laughs> yeah, that's definitely not meant for... <laughs> Alright, let's see. Yeah, we're going to go in that car with him. He's got a lot more room. You just had the money. Uh, I'm... I'm a wallet and phone was in your truck seat. Yeah, in my oh, pocket. The other guy that had the cash. Yeah, I got everything else. Okay. Uh, just hang out right here. I got to get started on paperwork. Can you? Yeah, go ahead. Help. What do you do with that paper, Megan? Yeah. It's got everybody's ID. I don't have to go digging for nothing. Man, who in the world can we donate this deer to this late at night? Uh, we'll try a fire station. Any of the fire stations up here, Teddy? They're not authorized to. Um, it'd be the church or Curtis Lucas. Yeah, I don't know anybody else up here. I just, man, that's a shame. <laughs> 